HIPAA is the acronym for the federal law known as the Health Insurance Portability and Accountability Act. This law first went into effect in 1996 and dealt mainly with insurance portability. In 2003, the law was expanded to cover protected health information, or PHI. The 2013 HIPAA omnibus ruling expanded the kinds of entities covered by HIPAA. It set nationwide privacy and security standards for protecting health care information in any form, oral, written, or electronic, and standardized the fines and penalties for violations. There are three groups that are required to follow HIPAA, covered entities, business associates, and business associate subcontractors. Covered entities include the following, healthcare providers, healthcare plans, health insurance companies, healthcare clearinghouses. Business associates are businesses that support covered entities. Business associate subcontractors are vendors that support business associates. A good rule of thumb is covered entities have business associates and business associates have business associate subcontractors. The compliance requirements for business associates and business associate subcontractors are now the same as for a covered entity. Some examples of business associates and business associate subcontractors are attorneys, IT contractors, billing companies, email encryption services, web hosts, health insurance agents, cloud storage providers. Essentially, if you come in contact with protected health information, you are required to be compliant with HIPAA. If an employer offers a health plan that stores health information, it is considered a covered entity. In most cases, the employer cannot separate itself from the plan, and now must protect all PHI generated by the plan as required by HIPAA. There are significant fines and penalties for companies that violate HIPAA and jail time for individuals who steal, sell, or use PHI for personal gain. To be compliant, you have three distinct tasks to complete. You must address technical, physical, and administrative concerns. First, technical describes how you will protect electronic health information. Physical how you will protect paper records and your physical site. Administrative deals with the documentation that is required to be compliant with HIPAA. All three parts are integral to being HIPAA compliant. Your first step to this process is to perform a risk assessment. This document will show you where you have holes in your technical and physical processes and will help you create the required privacy and security policies and procedures. These document how you protect all PHI you come in contact with and what steps staff must also take to protect this information. All staff that comes in contact with PHI, including everyone in HR, owners, advisors, and IT, are required to be trained on the HIPAA law as well as on your company's specific policies and procedures. The best business practice is to retrain employees annually. Today, we are dependent on technology to effectively and efficiently conduct business. You have a responsibility to protect your company's information and, in turn, your employees' information. HIPAA's technical, physical, and administrative guidelines are a great framework to not only help protect PHI, but HIPAA properly implemented can also protect your company against everyday threats. HIPAA is not a one-time deal, and your HIPAA compliance plan will continue to evolve as your company does. Thank you very much.